Today's a hunter strike challenge in 100 days. I'm working on uh, practicing with gauntlets, uh, my real steel hand axe, and helmet on. So more focus on fighting under weight than any particular strikes. I'm doing the very basic strike, punch, strike uh, with this. Focus on keeping my head up um, and uh, keeping that weight balanced on my helmet. I uh, did doing this right after uh, finishing a workout as well. So trying to come out of that, having my cardio up a little bit, and going right into the pell work. All right, helmet on, axe on, shield ready. If you can hear me in this, so 100 strikes, here I go. All right, a little over 100 strikes, uh, just practicing again, wearing the real helmet, real weapons and gauntlets, make sure you use that weight and under fighting conditions. So just 100 strikes uh, under the helmet, gauntlets on, um, fighting with the real weapons, make sure I'm training consistently with what I actually fight in. Again, for more information, uh, follow the knightshall.com or armored, sport, armored, com, armored combat sports.com. Links will be in the description below. Um, like and subscribe, leave me messages if, if there's any you'd like to see. Hopefully doing a video pretty soon coming up on um, kind of the difference between renaissance and reenactment armor. Not renaissance, reenactment armor. Um, and what we use, uh, kind of sport optimized, safe-ish armor for the sport. And how it can get you hurt wearing the wrong things. Um, so why you gotta listen to people and they tell you what to buy, especially your regional commanders, your team captains, etc. Um, any other topics you're looking for, let me know. I'm glad to put up a video with any kind of resources I have.